don't want anybody to come and take us uh, on our way. The Supreme Court, God has used Supreme Court to save Nigeria. God used Supreme Court to do what? Save Nigeria. Because the, the ruling party, they were astonished. In fact, they covered their concern. Even my colleagues, the governors of LP, some of them, they said, no, the party is gone. If you see how serious they were, that one man still talking about PDP is gone. PDP will never be there again. But God said, no, PDP will be there. And that's what has happened. So all of us should rise and make sure that from our world, from our units, our local government, we have to move faster for mobilization. We need more people. We don't need to chase people away. The umbrella is too big. It will accommodate every person. It will accommodate every person. I used to tell my commissioners before, I used to tell them that look, in governance, there are special advisors who are complaining about the way I do my thing. The same special advisors who are complaining, are the same people lobbying to the commissioners. Have you ever seen such a thing? Your special advisor complaining my style of administration, and you are the one lobbying to be a, a commissioner. I'm just looking at all of them with my vernacular. I'm not looking at all of them. I will not bring somebody who is not committed and loyal to the party. I will not. Everybody will be screened properly. It's not loyalty by bending them when you're putting off it. No. It's not that one. I won't take that loyalty. It's not that one. It's not loyalty when we are doing a, a banquet. You bring your head down. It's not that loyalty. It is a total loyalty. Now when we close our eyes, we can see loyalty. We can feel loyalty. So I'm not in a hurry. We are investigating, we are monitoring everybody. Those who are using uh, so many things, go to our pastors, pray. Me too, my pastors were praying. It will be, it will be prayer versus uh, prayer. So if you are praying, my pastors are also praying. As, as you are coming, they are looking at you. God will reveal to them. So this man who is coming, is it pure or not? So don't think that me too, I'm, I'm just like that. I'm not like that too. I am fortified by the men of God. So if you don't know that, I'm very much fortified. Go and cry. So, all you can do is to show that you believe in PDP. You believe in what? PDP. All those who were having two minds. Oh, well, PDP is finished. Mm. You know, it's just like when we are, went to the Supreme Court, when we lost the tribunal and lost the court of appeal, so many people started making contacts. That we are finished. I was just laughing. I know that this people don't believe in God. If you watch my political history, and those of you who know me very well, there is nothing I have achieved without God saying, Look, you to be easy. No, you will see it. It's not today that God has planned, prepared me. It's not today. I didn't even also know. I, I never knew. I didn't know that God was leading me. So if you know my history, what I passed through, for me to survive, you know that it didn't come just like that. And when it is turbulent, that is when we achieve. Anytime you see that it's turbulent, don't run away. Know that victory is uh, coming. But when it is easy, know that we're having problems. That's what has happened in our political history. Right for chairmanship of local government, down here. It has never been easy. I'm the first person who ran the election as chairman that got to the Supreme Court. In this state, I was the first person that the matter got to the Supreme Court. Just council chairman. 
Y la mafia. Cancel chairman. And you wonder, what are we dragging? So, it has never been easy. But I believe that God has a purpose for us. And I believe that we must be steadfast. What has happened should tell you, indeed, there is God. If you know what they did, but God said no, that it can't happen. I'm sure if it was contrary on Wednesday, so many of you would have left. So many of you would have uh, left. Assuming they said Sheriff, Supreme Court said, oh, we are firm Sheriff to be the chairman of the uh, PDP. Tell me. So, I'm from the government of the United States, listen, why would we have done it? Now that you have been captured, Abia would have been captured. All of us, but not all of you, Chief Aoussa, you are already, already almost there, you are caught you. Chief Fede, all of you, would have all, that's why we owe God a lot. We owe God uh, a lot. And I said, no, I cannot attend their national meeting if I don't confess. I said, I said, we must thank God. Because, but, I mean, God said, PDP because of the uh, reverse state. Don't say PDP because of the reverse state. Because we are the only state we have no any other uh, plan B. No plan D. Every other state they had a uh, plan D. We told God we can't have you and have a plan B. No. We cannot. It is that same he told us. That's how it is going to be. We cannot go and begin to talk about plan B. How do we do it? How do, where do we start from? So, when I see so many stage jubilating, as a kai, victory is sweet. <laughs> as a victory is uh, sweet. You can imagine if otherwise had happened. All over the uh, news media, they were said, is you know what you said? Wiki had destroyed PDP. Universal had destroyed uh, PDP. But our God has never put us to shame. Our God has never disappointed us. Our enemies will be put to shame from time to time. And we'll give him all the glory we we'll give him all the honor. So we can be proud and walk down to anywhere. If you're going to Abuja, move your two hands. Anybody that calls it on that says, yes, who are you? You say, who are you? You say, don't you know you're talking to a reverse man? We, we took the, we took the, God, Jesus, put reverse state in front. The God of reverse state will never disappoint reverse state. So I thank all of you for being firm. I thank the leadership of the party, Senator McAfee and his team. You see, when you see some people who are committed, they are committed. I thank our National Assembly members. The temptation at the National Assembly, every day has some real, one person with the camp, this person with the camp, the other fact, at the point, you get children and say, look, come and talk to some of my colleagues from social state. And we beg it. I said, don't leave PDP. PDP will not die. I will be going out to beg members outside our state, stay back. There is hope. Some will agree. The next day, they will declare in the floor that they are the, the defected. Some, some remain. That's to tell you how far. In fact, some time will get in that will bring them here. I will talk to them. I will beg them. I can assure you that PDP will not die. They say, sir. They will say, sir. <laughs> you know, his brother will go now before the father the uh, PDP. I said, look, have faith in God. There's no way Nigeria will be a one-party state. All these new political parties that are forming, 